skating yesterday so I didn't miss out on anything I'm thinking maybe next week maybe the week after it all depends on money time and what work I have left to do versus not but let's get this rolling let's get some butter in this thing I've heard this once or twice Now, actually, it works really well for this. Um, I do need another plate, though. There you go. The pressure's on. Good boy. <laughs> Alright, Saka. The pressure's on. This is a tidy piece. Good boy. Alright, Saka. The final the biggest best final piece. Good boy. This is called lightweight, by the way. It's still the group going. <laughs> we were like, maybe over the weekend, but no, Friday is uh, Emma's party, then Saturday is Michael's party, and Sunday is going to be recuperation time galore. So then we were like, maybe next week, but no, next week's plans are crazy as well, so maybe next weekend, who knows? Let's see what happens. Wow, wow, wow. Way you smile, the way you walk, the time you turn, teach me all that you had done. One more rainy. Seems that without you here, hair down the wreck. Since oh, you've been gone, now I'm a wreck. Time will heal, the pain will go away. Everything comes in you and it comes in waves. Broccoli, stop sliding off. 
Whoops. On a rainy day. Where's the box? Oh, waka 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 Most songs can be improved with a guitar solo. Um, let's do. Mm, how are we gonna do this? Mm, thank you, Andrew. Okay. Wow, this is a really good song. Going on to the current playlist. Add the playlist. Current. 1212 BTW. 1212 BTW. <laughs> <laughs> I'm make myself my tea. I'll be back for the food. So far, this is what it looks like. Okay, so we've got the chia butter. We've got some. Um, butter, so we've got chia butter and butter, and then we've got some cheese and cheese, and then we've got some tomatoes, tomatoes on top of it. Except these ones are slipping and sliding and falling all over the place. Dude, why? Hey, there you go, there you go. That's what it looks like so far. So let's leave it for the 10 minutes that I've put it on. I'll then come and replace these. I'm then going to add this onto some of them, and I'm going to add this onto some of them. Uh, we've also got a little bit of pork, but I was thinking of doing the pork and a gherkin on the side. And we each have three and a half of these. This is the opposite song of what we were listening to. Never mind, we actually just skipped it. <laughs> the singer is a female. Beautiful. But I actually want to get some voice. There. My apocalypse is here. This is her. Over there. Real Z's bros and homes. Uh, hoes and homies and bromies. Melting maple syrup? What the heck? That's right. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, go and check out the vlog's channel. And here we are. Yes! It did do some melting things. Great. Oh my god, but now the ants are taking it over. No ants. Okay, and into the tea it goes. I don't know, like, I can't judge how much is good or bad. <laughs> what is good or bad even? <laughs> Answer on my... <sighs> there you go. Let's stir it. Whoa! I wish you could smell it. <sighs> Let's go. I think I you <laughs> actually the aftertaste is pretty good. Please excuse me while you just face down on the counter. Let's see. Whoa, 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 whoa. And you'll notice that I rhyme all the time. And I just continue to do it. It literally tastes like if you put tea and maple syrup together. It tastes like that. <laughs> the time is 12.21. Just crazy. Just crazy. Anyways. I've paused that. I'm waiting for this to finish, but while I wait for this to finish, I can do other stuff. Uh, and what else am I doing? What else am I doing? What am I also doing? Tonight at 6 p.m. I gotta pay all the peeps. So we're gonna see all my money go away, and then we're gonna see some money come in. Because all my money is gonna go away to paying their salaries, or their, I don't even know what you would call them, but paying them for their services. And then I'm gonna get some money in for my services on social media. And then I have to survive on that 3,000 bucks for the rest of the month until the 25th. Wish me luck considering 7,000 rands worth of petrol in a month. <laughs> I honestly, I honestly, I'm just hoping that I don't have to drive every freaking where. Like if I can have more days like today, this month, that would be spectacular. The thing is, I know we are super busy. I'm happy to be busy. I don't mind being busy. It's the driving around that gets me with all the freaking spending money on petrol. Good, you good, you good, you good. I'm gonna do some Insu work, I'm gonna do some social media work, I'm gonna do some admin work, I'm gonna literally just sit down and get stuff done. The domestic worker at the place wanted me to get back in time for before she leaves because we have hit it off. This is the last time I'll see her because the person of the house that I'm looking after now is coming back on Friday. And this is her, she only comes back on Mondays and Wednesdays. Literally, if I leave this mouse on for 10 minutes, it drains like 10% of the battery. Literally, I'm not even joking. I cannot take any chances with that battery. In fact, leave in the comments below 
how long you think it'll be, how many days, how many days, give your suggested day or your respected, give your pre predicted, predicted day of when you think that mouse is gonna run out of battery. Okay, I've now put all of them in. These ones were the ones that were heated up for 10 minutes. These ones haven't been yet, but I did put the onion and ham on anyways. Are you keen? Someone wants attention. Someone wants some love. Cute. Good, good, good. Good. I could spend all day loving you, but I really can't, unfortunately, realistically. I can't do it. But in theory, I could do it all day long. Let's go. Bros, hoes, and me's. Hi. What's up? I'm in filming mode. These past two days, since the weekend, I've been in... Actually, no, over the weekend, I wasn't too much in filming mode. But but now, since Monday, since yesterday... No, Monday. Monday? Holy shit! It's already... No, wait. It's only Wednesday, isn't it? Yeah, it's only Wednesday. But still, it's already freaking Wednesday, dude. It's a we It is a Wednesday, my dude. Done my work. Got another video rendering. Got another uh, video compressing. Put my thing off now we're going to go and deal with the food okay so change of plans these look a little bit more ready than these now because these were on top of them so actually they kind of caught up with each other so now actually i should probably put these in there yeah Ooh, oh. Eh, I handled this. I think I can handle a couple freaking plates. Ah, it's okay. It's not on super hectic settings, so the plate will be okay. I am now sat here paying these peeps on for their work. Whoops, not there. I'm not yet done paying peeps, but I did hear this go off. Oh, look at that. Now that is what I'm talking about. When I started my spirituality, whoops, okay, three, 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 three is the number. I didn't understand stuff. And everything was very, very hard. And one of the things that helped me was I came across this, I don't even know what you'd call it. I, it was a website, but it wasn't really a website. It was more like they were promoting a certain thing, like a subscription platform. And I did subscribe. And ever since then, I get, I get guidance. I get um, angel message guidance. I get angel number guidance and now I'm getting the universe guidance as well is a third one that they've started sending my way but the angel numbers is the one I've always stuck to the most the angel the guidance from from my actual guardian angel is one thing but I want to talk about the angel numbers right now Angel numbers have always, especially these here, a lot of people would argue like it's a subscription, they, these things change, blah, blah, blah. And yes, it's true. And I've also dealt with that doubt myself, but there've been a number of these that have actually been what I needed to hear, or they've been directly related to what I was going through in my life, things like that. Now, this number was angel number 3333. It basically said that I, this is the beginning of a transition phase, um, was the main thing I want to take away from that. Also the fact that the Ascended Masters are with me and they're helping me and they're guiding me and the angels are with me. And I think you can kind of see where I'm going with this. I've been through this transition phase since the beginning. I've always been through it. It always is on the cusp of happening and then it doesn't happen. And I mean, I've even had direct communication with angels before about this. I was on shrooms at the time, but I was having a conversation because I was going through a, a high, a purging high that wasn't very nice. It was back when I was still, I wasn't new to shrooms, but, but shrooms were doing a lot less those sort of highs and a lot more enjoyable highs. And so when this happened, I was not very happy. In fact, I'll tell you the story quickly. I was driving in my car because what I did was I would take the shrooms then I'd take a little bit of weed and then I would get in my car and I would drive and I would spend the day doing that because as I was doing that I was just going through so much I was understanding epiphanies I was healing things I was getting over trauma I was dealing with insecurities there were times in those highs on those days where 
I got to a point where of security and self-assuredness that I had never experienced in my entire life. I had fear like you would not believe. Social anxiety, you don't even know social anxiety. One day, I walked to the shops. All I did was walk to the shops. On that stretch of road, as I was walking, I was in tears because of how afraid I was about how the cars driving across saw me. And now you see me and everyone goes, you're an extrovert, you're an extrovert. Dude, I made myself an extrovert. And the reason being was because I was tired of living like that. I was going to put myself into every uncomfortable situation that I could possibly think of. But the one that I could never get past was women. That was not a wall. That was a cathedral with a wall, with turrets, with a moat with an updrawn bridge, with another moat, with wild, crazy animals and creatures around it. That was so intense of a block that I could not get through it no matter what I did. And the shrooms were the ones that helped me do it. Those days where I had zero fear, I went from being on the outside of the jungle, going through the jungle, over the moat, over the second moat, into the cathedral, just walking in and being chill. I was so chill that I was doing things with women that I would never do before. Back in the day, I would see a pretty woman in a car behind me or a car in front of me and I would freeze and I couldn't do anything. I would literally freeze and I'd be petrified. Then with these shrooms, the help of these shrooms, I got to a point where I went from being that petrified, sitting still until she was gone, wherever it was, to being someone who was actually like smiling at girls as they were looking at me and, and waving and, and stuff. It was huge from going from that point of fear where i just described to being able to actually wave and smile at them and actually look at them and not be petrified it was mind-blowing that so that's just a little fun story about about how shrooms helped me back in the day how shrooms used to help me back in the day this next story is that phase where shrooms started becoming a little bit more purging so they had been purging it was more like i'd have a purge no, it was like I'd have a nice, nice purge. Nice, 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 nice purge. Nice, nice, nice purge. But now it's purge, purge, purge. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna end this video here so I can move on to that next video and add that next story time in. So like I said, guys, from the vlogs, you only got bits and pieces. Please go check out the story time channel to hear more about this. And guys on the story time channel, go check out the vlogs because there's a whole ton more of this weird ass stuff that happens to me. I even catch some of it on camera and this some of this is even without being on any plant medicine. Some weird stuff happens. Go check out the vlogs. All right, peeps. That story time, that 21 minute story time was very hectic. You can see me in tears, or I was in tears. Honestly, just go and check it out, honestly, okay? Um, I need plates now. What did I do with the plates? I know one is in here, and it's hot, but it's not super hot. Super hot, super hot. Get ready to be impressed. <sighs> oh my God. The color isn't doing too well, the kitchen light. There you go, that's a little bit better. Actually, no, let's try and change the, there you go. Oh, I've made lunch. That's okay, eat when you want. And now it's time for mine. Yes. Bing bang, food, let's give it a go. The pork obviously is good. Mm. Nice try, Welcome, obviously you. Mm. Now. She's so perfect sometimes I think she isn't real. For the actual taste test. Wow, look at that. Here we are going. Awesome. Let's see. Muy delicioso. 